I was feeling stuck and overwhelmed by uncertainty, and I found hope and self-confidence through brain education. My name is Panita, and I'm from Los Angeles, California. Brain education changed me from a person who I used to have a lot of overthinking and overanalyzing, and to the point where I got really stuck sometimes in my life. I couldn't uh, move forward. I was changing careers a lot. I couldn't decide, you know, what I wanted to study. And so I spent a lot of time wandering. Eventually, I found myself in a place where even though I was trying to get myself healthy, I was still feeling really anxious and depressed. And also my body became very stiff. And when I started doing brain education, I found I had a lot of stiffness and pain. And since uh, I started doing brain education, I was able to gain a lot more confidence and change my body condition. So now I can move my body more the way I want to. And it's been, um, I don't know, it's like really energizing now. I found brain education when a friend of mine invited me to a body and brain center. At first, my friend invited me to try a yoga class. And I said, well, you know, I have yoga classes near my house, so um, I'm OK. But then he said, well, how about Tai Chi? Have you tried Tai Chi? And I said, OK, no, I haven't tried Tai Chi. And so at first I wasn't sure, I was kind of nervous to go, but once I did, I just felt so great. After my first class, I was, I was really amazed by how good I felt and how you know, good it felt to be in the center. Everyone was just so friendly and I don't know, it just kind of stuck with me. My favorite brain education exercise is longevity walking. I love to walk, bringing the awareness to the bottoms of my feet. And then as I walk, I also stimulate my palms. And through that, I feel really connected to my whole body. And after I get really energized and walking for some time, my hands and feet get really warm. And I just love that, that feeling. Knowing what I know now, what I would say to my old self is to be a little bit brave, to take action, um, to really trust yourself that it's better to overcome that fear of failure actually to go through the failure is a lot more beneficial like it feels a lot better than that fear of the failure itself so what i would say is take a chance to try something maybe that really scares you <laughs> or makes you nervous because your sense of self-trust or you know that sense of um, being able to be proud of yourself is on the other side of that fear and uncertainty. I was feeling stuck and overwhelmed by uncertainty, and I found hope and self-confidence through brain education.